Hello everyone. Uh, welcome back to Free Call. This is the uh, England game. Now, um, we've been uh, poking along uh, doing stuff here and, uh, you know, getting stuff, uh, well, built up. And we're, uh, we're working on uh, getting uh, our infrastructure in place so that we can, uh, well, uh, start uh, start getting a uh, substantial uh, amount of Liberty Bell production and uh, start getting uh, uh, start getting a whole bunch of uh, artillery produced right and we're going to be uh, recruiting as many uh, as many um, uh, colonists as we can reasonably and that will uh, get us is because we're going to need a massive uh, army and uh, on top of that, a massive amount of uh, artillery uh, just to uh, make sure we don't lose uh, our uh, last coastal city. Uh, and we definitely don't want to lose our last coastal city uh, when we declare independence because then we lose. But let's just check in on the... Uh, who is it? Uh, is it the military advisor? Yeah. Uh, so uh, the expeditionary force has 47 uh, uh, infantry, 20 cavalry, and 28 um, uh, artillery at the moment. And that's quite a lot. Uh, and then if we, uh, I think it's the uh, naval advisor. And the expeditionary force has 16 um, man, uh, men of war, right? And that... Um, and that means they can bring, uh, uh, what is that? They could bring, what does a man of war hold? Four? Or is it six? I think it's six. Uh, so that means they'd be able to bring 90 odd uh, 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 troops or uh, uh, artillery uh, across all at once as it stands right now. And, of course, that will grow by the time we declare independence. And that's a balancing act. We want to declare independence as soon as we can reasonably defend ourselves. But we also want to avoid um, uh, doing it uh, too late, uh, too soon. Uh, as if we do that, then we lose, right? Now, as things stand, we've got uh, Popham and St. John's. Uh, and none such as our uh, coastal cities. And that's uh, definitely uh, going to be a, uh, a limiting factor. And what I, I think I want to do is I think I'm going to uh, take out the uh, uh, tribal village here. Um, so they're already pissed off, right? Uh, so I could uh, I could take them out. And uh, if I did that, uh, I'd have another good colony spot. And I think I think I kind of want to do that. So, um, uh, so I think that's what I'm going to uh, do here. Now we have uh, some artillery here, right? So I could bring some artillery down there. Uh, so let's, um, no, 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 um, go to, this takes a bit and, uh, later on, uh, I will probably, uh, edit out some of the, uh, Whoops. Some of the um, uh, troop movements. Uh, right. Okay. Now uh, we are going to defend our artillery as well. Nope. Um, Okay. Uh, 
right do that do that okay we will attack next turn okay now this is going to be all exciting and everything uh but uh yeah now if we get a treasure train from the village uh we're not going to cash it in right away we're going to uh we'll definitely uh, uh uh set that up just sit on it and uh and then uh, uh, when we uh, declare independence, we can cash them in at full price, right? So we, okay, we're, we just about have another, um, uh, okay, we, we've got a petty colony, a, a petty, criminal uh, uh, is now an indentured, indentured servant, right? And we got another one of these guys in, uh, in, uh, uh, um, what you might call it, uh, Roanoke, and uh, you know what? Um, I think another silver miner would do. Uh, you know that will uh, just mean all that much more silver gets collected uh, per uh, uh, caravan. Uh, okay. Um, okay. Now. Uh, if we do this, uh, we can attack, and we can let slip the dogs of war, and then we can go. Uh, yeah, of course they've declared war on us. And we have slaughtered an Arawak brave. Now, the reason I'm attacking with uh, artillery is... Uh, Is because if we lose, we just get a damaged artillery uh, with artillery. If we lose with uh, a dragoon, they get horses. Um, and that's uh, that's why I'm attacking with the uh, artillery. And uh, we've been doing uh, pretty good here. Um, yep. Okay, now we have uh, taken out the, uh, the settlement. And we got 300 gold, which we will uh, uh, sit on. Okay. Uh, now, uh, this uh, pioneer here, we're going to bring him down. And we're going to build a road down to none such. And I see I missed uh, Cooper's Cove as well. Um, okay, so these guys. Uh, well, I'm going to send one of these guys here. And is that where I want to put the colony? I think it has to be. Yeah, I think it has to be. It's on the forest, though. But I can't get all three forest tiles in there, so yeah. No, actually, it'd be better to put it on the marsh and forego that one forest tile, I think. Yeah. And then we get more land tiles, right? Okay, yeah, we'll do that. Um, you can go back here. Uh, you can go there. Um, what? Oh, um, right. Uh, we've got, uh, a pioneer who's a master weaver. So we're going to put the Master Weaver in there and take you out of there. Yep. Yeah, that, uh, that does seem like the thing to do. And you can come over here. Um, we don't have enough uh, food here. Um, you are... Oh, I'm training a farmer. Okay. <clears throat> And we've got uh, two more turns for a farmer. Yep. 
Okay. Yeah, okay. And four more turns for an Elder Statesman. Okay. Good. Right. Uh, okay. Now, uh, we keep on uh, trucking here. Uh, really, there isn't much to, uh, to do here. Um, we have built a fort in St. John's. Uh, we have a ship in London. Now we're building a, uh, what are we doing? We are building a, uh, fortress. Yeah. Uh, so we definitely want those in our main cities because they will make it harder for the, uh, expeditionary force, I think, to, uh, to do anything. Okay, you can go in there. Now, can, is there anybody useful we can recruit in two turns, 222 gold? Um, no, what, what we're going to do is uh, uh, move this up. And uh, we don't have enough to equip as a Dragoon. Okay, well, we're going to um, park our ship there for a while. And, uh, right. Well, we can go here and here. Yeah. Uh, okay, now what can we do here? Well, we can uh, send another colonist down there. Okay, now uh, that guy... Um, that's a privateer, right? Uh, yeah. Uh, right? Okay, well, if we go up here, let's attack this guy. Okay. Right. Okay, now you go up and you can make a road. You can go over here, right? And we will uh, lay the foundations, I think. Uh, this gets us sugar, so that's, uh, that's not terrible. Um, right, and, uh, yeah, we'll let that, we'll let that, uh, stand as it is. Okay. Uh, okay, now we, uh, continue on here. Now, I think we're going to be in a situation where we get uh, uh, quite a few more, uh, uh, more, more things to do each turn. So, okay, now we have uh, another farmer. So, uh, that sorts out food for a bit. We've got full production here, and we've maximized our food and lumber production. So, now it's just a matter of... Uh, uh, producing uh, the appropriate amount of other stuff here. Um, so what what uh, what I'm going to want to do is uh, I should probably set up a colony that does uh, horses, breeds horses uh, that just just does food. Yeah, that might be uh, that might be smart. You know, if we can breed horses at a ridiculous rate. Yeah, that'd be good. Because um, we're getting three horses per turn out of this. Um, okay, we need a tobacconist, actually, in the colony. Uh, that would be good. Right. Okay, and we also need this to get up to 100% uh, 
Turns to reach uh, 222 turns. Yeah, we definitely need more uh, more Liberty Bells. We've completed a lumber mill here. Right, so we're building stuff a little bit faster here now. Um, right. Now, we... Uh, Uh, right, we were, uh, what were we doing over here? Um, right, uh, okay, well, I think we should plow that, right? Uh, okay, now we're, uh, in investigating, really? Uh, we're investigating stuff over here. Yeah. Okay. And then we can do this. Uh, fortify. And uh, fortify there. If we attack here... Ah, we can grab this and this. Okay. Okay, so that was definitely uh, worth doing. Uh, now, as long as we don't, uh, we are going to reject the king's offer. That's a bug that it asked you twice. Uh, right. Uh, close that. And, uh, oh, right, we can uh, drop you here and uh, you, uh, wait, you can, uh, no, you can stay there and you can be a farmer. Uh, really? Interesting. Okay, well, we'll let the farmer be there. And uh, you can also be a farmer. Yeah. Right, okay. What? They despise our goods, be gone. Yes, of course they do. Um, right. Now, is there somebody reachable from the river here? There is. We'll go there. Uh, okay, so we can uh, make the wagon train sleep. And then on we go. Okay, now we've got a free colonist. Here, yeah. And we have a blacksmith shop here. Right. Okay. Um, and we have a free colonist here. Um, now, you can be a dragoon. Um... Yeah, and then you can go to St. John's. Okay. Uh, good. And then you... Uh, what do you want? Uh, rum, of course. Uh, wait, what? Who? What? Okay. Well, you... Uh, we'll speak to the chief. We get nothing there. Uh, you can... Now, what can we sell here? A hundred cloth uh, for 537. We'll accept the offer. Cancel. 
Now we can go, oh, I set sail already, right, okay. Now, we can send uh, the privateer uh, back to St. John's. So that silver will go off to Europe. Now, uh, cigars will accept the offer. Okay. Uh, so we got a bunch of gold this turn. Uh, we'll also sell the coats there. Um, right. And so that was worth going over there for sure. Uh, we have a new colonist in Roanoke. Uh, okay. Uh, right. Okay. Well, I think I'm going to drop them in the uh, uh, city hall there. Or town Town hall. Uh, get some more uh, Liberty Bells there. Uh, we have an elder statesman here. Uh, which we can now drop in here and get even more uh, Liberty Bells here. Um, and uh, right, now we can get uh, 23 turns to 100% now. Uh, okay, uh, and we've got, uh, the blacksmith, uh, four more turns on the blacksmith. Okay. Good. Uh, right. Okay. Well, we're doing, we're doing fine there. Okay. Uh, James Ford has completed a lumber mill, so now we're going to build things faster. That's fine. Uh, okay, here we go. And, uh, okay, nothing much to see here. Uh, if we go to that tile, cancel that. Um... Right, we're going to sell the coats. We'll accept that offer as well. And we'll cancel that. And then you can go back to St. John's. Right. You can... We're, we're going to end the turn. Okay. Um, okay, we got a hundred silver, which will unload and that will get sold. Okay. Okay, on we go. Yeah, the turn didn't actually end because of the uh, carrier arriving in St. John's. Now, um... We have completed an artillery in Harbor Grace. And, uh, yeah, okay. We can uh, continue building artillery there. That would be good. Uh, new colonist and none such. Uh, what does that get us here? Well, we can drop the guy in here. You can go to be a lumberjack. Yeah, yeah, I think that's, uh, that's sensible. Um, right, good. Uh, less than 10 units of lumber in here. Yeah, there is. Um, change work, lumberjack. You know, you can be food. Yeah, put a lumberjack up there. Good. Um, okay, and we're stable in there, so that's fine. And we sold a bunch of silver. Um, that's uh, the supply and demand, right? Uh, Hardy Pioneer has used up all his tools. Um, 
Right. So Roanoke, we're now producing one spare food. Right. Okay. Uh, you can go to London. Yeah. Okay. You can come along here. Okay. Harbor Grace. Uh, well, we're going to fortify uh, St. John's. Uh, where are we? Okay. Yeah, we're going to attack. Um, what the? Privateer has damaged the caravel. Okay. Now we'll, we'll go to uh, St. John's. Okay. And turn. And we're going to have our... Uh, oh! Uh, so we got uh, Adam Smith. Okay. Okay. Uh, Uh, Coronado, that's not terribly useful. Uh, John Paul Jones might be. Pocahontas might be. Yeah, John Paul Jones. Okay, now we can build factories. Uh, and that'll be uh, potentially useful, right? Uh, but anyway, uh, we'll go up here to Harbor Grace, where we can uh, equip with tools again. Yep, okay. And here we can fortify. And we've got a road into Hampton. And we're going to make a road all the way down. And over here, we have established that there is nothing to see uh we'll speak with the chief there yeah there's nothing to see there uh okay well we'll send you back to st john's okay uh okay what have we got here this um i think we should start producing muskets what do you think uh that does seem like the thing to do so we're going to start producing muskets Okay. Now, where would be a good spot for a food colony? Right? And I... Hmm. Yeah, see, we don't have an absolutely brilliant food colony here, do we? Uh, James Fort, though, actually is pretty good for food. Um... Once I, but it'll be good for building stuff as well because uh, that's uh, that's rainforest. Uh, so we got, oh, we'll be able to build artilleries here. Um, yeah, that might be the thing to do. Um, okay, once we can convert our uh, colon our uh, converts to uh, colonists. Uh, yeah. Um, okay. I. Uh, Right. Nothing is being built here. Uh, okay. Well, what can we build here? Well, a lumber mill uh, seems like a good idea. Uh, probably a warehouse. And probably that. And a stable. And I think an armory. Yeah. Yeah, we'll build that stuff there. And, uh, I guess you're producing, yeah, we'll, uh, we'll leave that. You can, yeah, we'll leave that as is. Okay. Uh, okay. Uh, right. Uh, Harbor Grace would actually be a really good food colony. 
if it if it weren't for the uh, uh, production of uh, hmm. Well, uh, what I can do up here is uh, let's uh, let's look in here. So we're producing food over here. Yeah, okay. So we'll go over here and uh, yeah, we'll, we'll start making fields. Uh, you can uh, do your thing. You can go to London. Okay. You can make a road. Yeah. Okay. Uh, onward. We have uh, maxed out our uh, blacksmith here. So, so if we do this, we've got 24. Uh, right now. Okay. Right. In here, let's buy the fortress. Yes. Okay, now, what's after the fortress? No, 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 no. We need a blacksmith shop after that. And then an ironworks. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Close. Uh, our ship has arrived in London. Okay, we have this guy. We'll equip as a dragoon. Yep. Okay, so far so good. Make the ship go to sleep. Uh, cancel that. Okay. Moving along. Okay, St. John's has a fortress. Now we just need to build, uh, okay, two turns and we'll have, okay, we should be producing a lot more tools. And then, uh, <clears throat> yeah, so we're going to need a master gunsmith. Um, yeah. Uh, so the goal here is to get it to the point where we're producing an artillery every four turns. As I think that's how often you can do it. Uh, an artil artillery is 192, I think. Uh, yeah, it's every four turns. Right. And we have an indentured servant. You can go over here. You can also be a dragoon. And you can go to St. John's. Okay. Um, docks were destroyed. Uh-huh. Right. Okay. What I should do... Well, you can be a Dragoon. Okay. And uh, you can, uh, I can activate you, right. Okay, now you can go here. Yeah. What have we got here? Uh, right. Okay. Uh, well, if we take that, and that okay we're going to go trading with the uh, privateer
Uh, James Fort, we're running out of lumber. Well, yeah, we're going to run out of lumber. That's fine. Uh, yeah, we're doing fine there. Okay. 26 food has been stolen by Arawak Brave. Uh, that's fine. Um, okay. Now, uh, up here we have a Dragoon, which we can uh, bring... Whoops. Uh, we can uh, grab another one of those. Now you, right. Um, what about um, you? Cloth, they are interested in cloth. Uh, go there, okay. Now you, uh, yeah, okay, you need to go this way, right, okay, you can go in there, okay, well, uh, we have a uh, boat in London. So you can uh, sleep, okay, and uh, where are we here? Okay, uh, in Roanoke we have an expert farmer. Okay, that's actually good. Uh, and none such, we have completed an armory. And we're building something else. Uh, we are now having a ceasefire with the Arawak. Okay. Oh, and we have a blacksmith shop in uh, London. Uh, okay, so we're uh, we're building stuff. Uh, we have six more turns to build the ironworks, and that is fine. Uh, good. Um, where are we here? Okay, we're going to take this guy closer there. You. Okay. You fortify. Harbor Grace. Now, how's Harbor Grace doing? Seven. Okay. And we go up here, and we'll plow that too. Okay, we'll end that turn, and then we'll see what happens. As I think this next turn is where I'm going to put the cut. Uh, okay, uh, we have an indentured servant here, so you can go here. Now, uh, recruit. Uh, master distiller. Uh, that'll come eventually. Train. Ma uh, master Gunsmith. We'll bring a Master Gunsmith. Now, do we have enough to make a Dragoon? We do. So you can go to St. John's. Okay. Good. Um, we're almost full up on horses in Harbor Grace. And a new Cherokee convert has arrived in Harbor Grace. Well, uh, if we make you a uh, farmer, we can have even more food. Yeah. Uh, okay. And if we go in here, uh, we can make a wagon train and then artillery. Yeah. Okay. Uh, you can uh, kind of cheese things by using uh, wagon trains as extra warehouse storage. Um, okay, you go here. Okay, 
you go in here and fortify, you can do some plowing. Yeah. Unload those guys. Now, uh, what have we got here? We've got, uh, we got a, uh, indentured servant and a free colonist. Okay. Well, we're going to stick the indentured servant there and we're going to train a, uh, another, uh, um, whatchamacallit, a, um, uh, uh, elder statesman. Uh, so we, we can max out uh, Liberty Bells in uh, at least St. John's. Uh, the more Liberty Bells we generate, the better off we are. Uh, okay. Uh, we need to do some farming over here. We are using up our uh, ore, but uh, our uh, trade lines should bring more in. Okay. Uh, so that's going to, so that, that's definitely where I'm going to put the cut. So uh, I guess, uh, yeah, that's going to be all this time. So, you know, stay healthy. Uh, don't let the ongoing apocalypse get you down too much, especially now that there seems to be a light at the end of the tunnel. And uh, see you back next time.